Welcome to the world according to Jason. Today we are in the Amalfi Coast, actually in Amalfi, and we're here at Bistro Filipas Panza. I don't know how to pronounce that. I butchered it. Name's going to be down on the screen below, but we're here to try out some authentic, amazing Italian food. So we ordered an appetizer. We got their uh, meat and cheese board. Also has a little bit of fruit on it, some walnuts. Uh, we're gonna just see what is, there's some different salamis. Looks like a prosciutto, um, a, maybe a pear and different types of cheese. Let's go with a, some of the salami here. All right, going in. Mm. Oh, that is really good. Nice and floral. Got the peppercorns inside of it for that nice peppery kick. The meat is nice and tender. Let's try out this cheese. Oh, I'm not sure what kind of cheese this is. Almost tastes like maybe like a, a Parmesan. It's not, it's not too like pungent. It's very creamy, very light. Mm, delicious cheese. Okay, I'm gonna try out this pear with a little bit of salami. Actually, I'm gonna try it with a little bit of cheese. So pear and cheese, that's really nice. The fruit and the cheese together is perfect. All right, uh, it also has some walnuts, which are good. Let's try a little bit of, I think this is prosciutto. I'm not an Italian meat specialist, but it looks really good nonetheless. Let's try it out. Oh, that's my favorite. Oh my gosh, beautifully thinly sliced. Fatty, meaty, it just, oh, it is so amazing. That is such a good flavor. A little bit, a little bit of a smoky flavor. I wanna try some of that with the fruit. I don't know if this is an atrocity or not. Please forgive me if it is. Mmm, mmm. That pear adds a nice complexity to the meat. Nice, juicy, savory flavor with the sweetness of the pear. That is amazing. All right, well, that is a really awesome starter. Highly recommend you get this. We do have a couple pastas coming. So as soon as those come, we'll be right back. All right, so our pastas have just arrived and oh my goodness, they look amazing. We got the Amalfi style ravioli in a cherry tomato sauce. And then we also have the pasta carbonara. And they, they said that they make their pasta by hand here, fresh daily. So this should be Pretty dang amazing. Inside the ravioli is a cheese blend. I think it was Romano and Parmigiano. So uh, let's give this a taste. Oh wow, these are big pieces of ravioli. You can kind of see in there, you can see the cheese. All right, let's go in for it. Oh. Oh my God. That is mind blowing, mind blowingly good. The pasta is so al dente, perfectly cooked. The cheese is so creamy. This sauce, this cherry tomato sauce is so bright and so acidic. It is so flavorful. This is so amazing. It, I, I don't know what else to say. This is, this is just, this is a special moment. My first pasta in Italy and I'm loving it. I'm speechless. I really don't know what to say. This is, I want to move here. I want to move here right now and I want to eat this every day. This was so phenomenal. Super high hopes for the fettuccine. All right, so we're moving on to the pasta carbonara with fresh Parmesan on top. This, I mean, this pasta looks so, so amazing. All right. Going in. Oh. I'm speechless with this as well. The pasta is perfect. I cannot remember when I've had pasta this good. The sauce is super creamy, super creamy. Nice bacon taste. I mean, 
If you love pasta carbonara, this is probably gonna be like the best you've ever had in your life. What a beautiful first meal in Amalfi. I'm so glad I came here. We have a lot more to see, a lot more food to try. So make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you hit that notification bell. So as soon as new videos from Amalfi and other videos pop up, you'll be the first to know about it. Thank you so much for sticking around to the end. Until next time, stay curious.